All right, so I'm excited to show you these because it's a pair of shoes that I actually had in the past. I did sell them because I needed the funds to buy something else. I sold them and I, and I think at back at that time, it was like, I think I profited like 800 bucks or something like that. And I used those funds to, I think I bought like a few more, few more shoes. Anyways, it's a shoe that I've been wanting to get back into my collection. When you get a box, when you get a box like this, it does come from Adidas. So you already know what it is. It's a shoe that I've been meaning to get back to my collection. And I just, I didn't see myself spending the, the, the amount of money for the shoe. So patience is key. Um, and I patiently waited and they were on the Adidas Confirm app. I had it on my wife's phone. And then I also had um, my cousin try to get it for me. And one of my friends tried to get it for me. and. I was nervous because I did not think I was going to hit on these sneakers because it seems like with the Adidas Confirm app, the sneakers that I really want, I don't hit on. Uh, and the ones that I hit on are the ones that I don't want. Anyways, there you go. It is a Yeezy 350, my favorite Yeezy silhouette. As far as like the Yeezy collection goes, just like they never left. As far as the Yeezy silhouettes go, I prefer the 350 simply because it's it's more of a comfortable shoe for me. For me, it's a, it's more of a comfortable shoe. I prefer the 350 over the 700s, even though a lot of people say that the 700s are pretty comfortable. Uh, not for me. I prefer these right here. This silhouette is my favorite silhouette from the 350s. I don't like all the 350s that come out, but this is one that... Man, I've been wanting to get back in my collection. Smells so good. And I'm glad, I'm glad I got them back. Um, again, like I said, I've, I had them in the past and I did sell them. Um, I, I did I did sell them. So I'm kind of glad I got these. And I'll show you the other 350s that I have. These I've had probably like three pairs of these. <clears throat> these are the ones that I have dead stock, but haven't worn them yet. Just got these recently uh, on the Adidas Confirm map. I did do a review, check that one out, but pretty excited. And I, and I have wore these. I actually wear these quite a bit, especially to the gym. My first pair of Yeezy 350s are these right here, which I wear these a lot, but just don't wear them that often anymore. Another one that I wear a lot are, are these right here. I wore these to the gym and I just I just wear them out because it's, it's an easy like color to just throw on. Another one of my favorites, this one here. And the sulfurs, <clears throat> which I haven't worn yet. Um, I kept going back and forth and back and forth whether to keep the sulfurs or not. Um, I, I've kept them. I haven't sold them yet. <clears throat> when you look at the, um, if you look at the supply for this demand, there's no more supply of this shoe. So I'm kind of thinking of just keeping them. Um, again, I haven't worn them, but those are all my 350s. But initially, you can't really see this one. Um, I personally really, 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 really dig, dig this shoe. If I compare it to this one here, if you look, if you look at the uh, the speckles on it, I like that. This is just a solid black shoe, <clears throat> but this has a lot of speckles on it, which I really love and I really missed. <clears throat> Again, I sold the shoe, uh, one that I've been wanting back in my collection. And one thing that I like that Yeezy's doing, and I and I felt like they were gonna do it anyways because Jordan does it all the time. They just bring back old colorways. Old colorways. It's not good for the resale market, but it's good for somebody like me who wants to wear the shoe. Um, Jordan has been doing that a lot. So, I mean, a lot of people are saying that they don't like the fact that Yeezy's bringing out all these shoes again. I do. There's a lot more of these that they're bringing back out, which I'm pretty excited about. The one that has the red <clears throat> Yeezy supply, those are the ones I'm looking forward to too. But nonetheless, it's a shoe that I'm happy to get back in my collection. 
I'll do some more feeds for you, but I can't wait to start rocking these. Thanks. When I do on feeds, I don't really talk about the shoe, but I think I am on this one. What I like about the, the strap going down the middle is it's, it's like a statement. You, you're walking down, you're gonna definitely notice a shoe like this. As far as comfort wise, if you haven't tried Boost already, I still think Boost is life. I'm a big Boost guy, and it's a comfortable shoe that you can wear, and your feet's not your feet's not gonna hurt simply because of that tech right there. And it's all throughout the shoe. Black black shoe, a little white. It's kind of like an off white sort of. It's not like a white white, but it's like an off white. Look at the speckles. Speckles are super dope. It's again, it's it's a really really good shoe. I can't wait to start rocking these because again I've had one, sold them, but you put them like this together. But you definitely see these coming. Definitely see these coming. Definitely check them out. Resale is not that crazy, not like it used to be. I mean, it is kind of high up there, but. Something I think you should, I recommend.